interesting. Well, hopefully with the help of the sheriffs and also patrol moms, um, we'll have a safer environment for definitely, children, definitely. definitely. All right, thanks so much for the report. All right, thank you. Many here in the nation may not have heard of the Eastern European country of Belarus, but it's getting much more attention these days due to efforts to attract Korean students to study abroad. Right. For students who want to study Russian, Belarus says they're a better bet. A delegation from Belarus recently made an agreement to set up an academic exchange program with Korea University, which many hope will foster closer ties between the two countries. For some Koreans, Belarus is an unfamiliar country. However, the number of students going to Belarus to study is growing. Belarus is in Eastern Europe and next to Poland and Russia. And is also known as White Russia. It shares many political, economic, and social similarities with its neighbor, Russia. This is Korea University, one of Korea's most prestigious universities. Inside the classroom, a lecture on Russian language and literature is in full swing. Students are attentively listening to every word the lecturer says. With Russia mounting a blue ocean strategy to promote itself in the world, the number of people learning the language is growing. The demand for experts at Russian language is bound to climb day by day. Thus, students here are putting in their best efforts. The number of students going abroad for language study program is growing. And students in Russian language and literature are no exception. On March 28th, representatives from a Belarusian university visited Korea University. They were here to showcase Belarus's diverse and methodical education system, as well as Russian language study programs. The Belarusian delegation and representatives of Korea University conducted lengthy talks to put together an agreement for academic exchanges. Я думаю, что с каждым днем, с каждым месяцем и годом оно будет расти, расти и расти. Это сотрудничество. Okay, you see, I come here just to take part in an ed educational exposition, and we told our Korean partners about our possibilities, about possibilities of studying in the Republic of Belarus. Finally, both parties signed the agreement, which touches on language programs and exchange student policies. With such an agreement in place, both universities will invest into improving education quality and promoting cultural exchanges. Students will reap the benefits by receiving an even higher quality education. Uh, it's time for the Belarusian delegation to go on a tour of Korea University.
They had an opportunity to explore Korean college education system, considered to be one of the best in Asia. Besides the tour and the discussions, the most important event was yet to come. Students studying Russian language and literature had a rare chance to meet Belarusian representatives who gave them plenty of information about studying in Belarus. Participating students were all eyes and ears during the presentation, as it was full of information hard to find elsewhere. A very informative question and answer session took place, which helped fill in many blanks in the students' heads about studying in Belarus. With those blanks filled, a new dream to study in Belarus began to form. Many students are planning to study abroad or take language programs to become more in sync with the global community. The agreement made between Korea and Belarus will help students in both countries come one step closer to that goal and allow Korea and Belarus to foster many talented people in the future. Hiking up.